Yo, what's up guys? Chase the Bro here, and welcome back to another Elden Ring build video. Today we're going to be trying a pure strength build with the glass cannon setup that I've been enjoying. Strength builds already have some really high damage output, so I figured pairing some of the lighter strength weapons on this build would make it pretty powerful. Starting with the Warped Axe, this is definitely one of the stronger weapons on a strength build. It does get an S scaling, and it performs extremely well with Spinning Slash. It true combos, does immense damage, and with the base setup, it has 855 AR. We can push that damage even further with the Exalted Flesh, boosting it from 855 to 1026, and then we can use the Kindred of Rot's Exaltation to boost our power further by just poisoning ourselves, so we use the Rope Fetid Pot, and then you just heal it to make sure you don't take any more damage, and our AR is 1231 for 20 seconds while that's active. This can absolutely one-shot somebody, honestly, it's kind of scary how powerful you can make builds with this setup. The same goes for the Banished Knight Greatsword, it has 1184 when buffed up like this, and it gets a true combo of jumping R1 to R1, so you can easily delete somebody like that. If you're somebody who enjoys buffing, you can actually push it a little bit further. Make sure you eat your Exalted Flesh, make sure you poison yourself of course, but then you can also buff your weapon afterwards as well. So you can use Jawstring Grease, and then the AR is going to be around 1363 with a fast light weapon like this. What would it be on the Greatsword, honestly, I'm curious. 1316. <laughs> so yeah, you can definitely push a lot of setups to some maximum damage this way. I have been testing out a lot of different talisman setups, so if you are someone who likes to use dual straight swords or anything that consecutively attacks, you could replace some of these for more of the consecutive attack talismans, but I feel like for the way that I play, the Kindred of Rot works a little bit better. I'd rather buff up than just jump into the fight and be strong for 20 seconds straight. As for the stats, I'm just running a pure strength build, nothing too complicated here, and then the minimum endurance that I need to wield the weapons that I plan to use while having my light load. That really covers everything there is to say about the build, though. Let's just see how it performs in the invasions. Yes, a castle soul invasion. I love these. And they're by the grace. Perfect. Nice and easy to find. And it's easy to buff up. Hello there, Akendless. How are you guys? Hello. I'm going to buff up here. Oh. Madness. You popped my bubble, dishonest. Ooh, I'll get madness real quick, though. I got to be careful. That's important. Although, they probably don't understand how strong this can be. Whoop. Get rid of the poison. Alright, now, I could go for a little bow fun here. This could be fun. <laughs> no one knows its true power. Hey there. Ooh, okay, good connection on that. I don't want to get hit by madness, though. We'll keep dwindling them down with the bow. Oh, especially the wizard right now. Pineapple Joe, take that. No, did that wizard have 300 HP? Is that what I just witnessed? Can you even have that? How does one have that? Hey there. My axe. Excuse me, I have protection bubbles that need to go up. Okay. It is important. Keep your onion rings away. And then I poison and heal. Hey there. <laughs> that does such ridiculous damage. <laughs> we'll twirl for the win too. Oh my god. This kind of build actually works so well for how I play. You isolate one for a second and then you can just delete them. We've invaded Rombo in the Halig Tree. Ooh, they have a phantom. Good sign, good sign. Are they right in front of me here? Oh, they are. Perfect. Okay. Let's get our setup going. Oh, there might be three players. I see lightning being cast. Oh my god, the wizard. Let's just try to do the jump attack to surprise them. I wonder how much the jump attack combo does. Hi, guys. Now we're going to have to find out with precision jump attacks. Oh. Oh my god. Did that just do 20? Oh, he was poisoned. Okay, okay. Or Scarlet Rotted gonna say there's no way that did that much damage right that was too much <laughs> but still the fact that I can two shot with this is scary <laughs> when it has a true combo Ooh. <laughs> oh the yellow annex tunnel and right at the beginning as well all right what do we want to go in there with then Twin blade. I feel like I'm loving the warped axe on the strength version. Let's let's do that a little bit. Hello there. Or or we could also try this for fun. Hi guys. <laughs> it's never not fun doing this. What the? Is someone invisible right there? Um. 
Oh, he's not summoned yet. Oh, that makes sense. That makes a lot of sense. Hi, guys. Hello there, Mr. Wizard. Alright, I see you got some wizardry in that hand of yours. I'm not a huge fan of that, and that would be why I was doing this. <laughs> gonna make him chase me a little bit, otherwise he's gonna have an issue. Whoa, we trade. <laughs> we won shots. Now. Woo! Let's trade again, guys. You're next. <laughs> you would have been last. Oh man, honestly, I feel like I really do like the glass cannon builds. Oh my god, Storm Hill. Hello there, Katana user. I'm gonna walk away from you. I also could have a Katana. Ah, my iframes weren't over yet. We're not done yet here, okay? It's not over. It's not over yet. Excuse me. The setup takes a little bit longer. Requires a little bit more precision and power. <laughs> I do so much damage, it's hilarious. I'm gonna pretend to go for this one. But then spin on you! Spin to win! Spin to win! <laughs> oh, no one expects this little axe to have such damage. Oh man. You have the poison going, I'm pretty sure it touches a thousand. Yeah. With the fast speed spinning slash, this is pretty scary. The Great Bridge area with GT Simon. I got a bad spawn, but we're gonna hope this brings me closer to them. And it did. It indeed did. Hi guys. Oh, that's rough. I don't have high frames. <laughs> Instant bleed. <laughs> hey there, guys. Listen, I know it looked like you're gonna two-shot me, and you could. You very well could. But there's this thing that I can do that's quite scary. Let me just gear up for it, okay? I promise when I'm when I'm full form here, you'll understand my true power. <laughs> All right, and we'll do the bubble. And then we go for the trade. Oh, I didn't think he was gonna do an L2 there. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna admit the blood streams are a problem for me here. But bam, they become no longer a problem when we're close to me. <laughs> and then you're gone, just deleted, just like that. <laughs> now, what do we want to do to Sir l 2 a lot? I'm also Sir l 2 a lot on occasion, but you know, he kind of l 2 more. Let's dodge these patiently waiting for our opening. I just buff up a little bit here. I haven't really used the Twin Blade at all. Oh, what's our crit like on this? Ooh, it's going to be pretty devastating. Not that he has much absorption either. <laughs> Goodbye, GT. Alright, a castle soul invasion. Let's go. Maybe team by the grace? Seems like they already took out the lion. Hello there, sir. How are you? Hi there. Hi guys. Ooh, let me buff up a little bit here. Oh, shield. A little bit of teleporting. That never hurt anybody except me. <laughs> Light roll can be very nice. Whee! Both of you at once. No? Okay. I'd be a little bit more aggressive. Oh, ho, ho, I do bleed into it when I'm naked like this. So there's that. Oh, but I do a ridiculous amount of damage when I land my hits. Oh, boy. <laughs> okay, I want to test this now. All right, Gills. Come at me. I'm going to poke your shield and then go into this. <laughs> I just want to see the full damage of the spinning slash on this. Huh. Huh. And that was only two hits. Oh my god. Okay. Okay, let's try other things. We have him as a test. I like this. I like this. I want to see running heavy to spinning slash. Okay, I think he's dead. <laughs> Thank you so much for the body test, my friend. I appreciate it. All right, we've invaded Mount Gelmir, and we're nowhere near a boss fight. So I do love that. Uh, let's get buffed up. I see wave of gold in my future. <laughs> Alright, let's just see. Oh, why would you hit me? Specifically. I even buffed him. So rude. Hi hey there. How are you guys? Who's your teammate? So, that's Mick O'Neill. I was gonna say, if you ruin this for me, Iron Carriage, I swear to God. Iron Maiden, go away. Whee! 
I've only been hit by the PvE. Please. <laughs> okay, we're just gonna take the blue out because he thinks I'm weak. Oh no, he doesn't. Okay. We got a lot of katanas in here. Okay, there we go. It's funny because I'm buffing the PvE. It's pretty hilarious. But <laughs> you didn't do the follow-up though, man. You must have low stamina. Yeah, you did. Alright, blue. What's going on over here? Huh. Oh no. Oh, there goes- wait. Does he have the elemental physic going? <laughs> Hello. <laughs> the katana dude definitely did. That's funny. I didn't even notice him drink that, but that's hilarious. Alright, so we've invaded the Mogwin Palace. Hello there, Selfish. How are you? And Teddy. What's up, guys? How's it going? Um, let me just do this really quick. I have some buffs to apply before we get into our full form. Yes. Alright, I'm ready if you guys are. I'm ready. Let's see the destruction of Spinning Slash on this. Oh. Or the blender. Okay, we still go in. One hit did 900 damage. <laughs> okay, we just need to land the combo and we'll be good. Oh! <laughs> I knew that was going to kill the host. And I knew we could probably do it in the time of that actually hitting me. <laughs> the damage output's just so fun. Every trade you win, even though you don't have that much absorption, I feel it gives me 15, so it does help a little bit. Oh, the Annex Tunnel with Rivel. Alright, Rivel, let me just buff up here ahead of time so I don't have to worry about it. We do the Poison Pot last, yeah. It lasts the least. Oh, Wizard! I don't know if the Wizard is prepared for what's about to happen. Oh, I wasn't prepared for that, to be honest. One hit on the host did 1,200. I know they were memeing. Uh, the Phantom almost surprise attacked me, though, to be honest. Oh. <laughs> I don't know if this is going to go well for Rivel, but you know what? This is a good time where we can test out this. Um, yeah, you know, this probably does better. Oh, they quit out. <laughs> That's funny. Unable to summon cooperator. I don't like that. We need teams. Alright, let's buff up. So we can take a nice trade. Hi guys. How are you? Oh. Wizard. Oh. You broke my beam. Both of you. Whoa. Actually, my L2 didn't come out there. I'm kind of sad. Oh. Holy. Wizard damage when you're naked is not to be desired. We are not going to take that to the face. Whee! Okay, I want to take out the wizard first. Hey, wizard. Spin to win! Oh, you actually just took that to the face. <laughs> Free heal. I'll take that, I'll take that. Definitely, definitely. Alright, now that we're just alone with him, we can dodge his attack and then go for the trade. Oh, he's light rolling! He's light rolling with a great sword! Oh my god! That's pretty cool. That was unfortunate for him. <laughs> we did almost one shot him with one hit, not even a combo. But achieving the light roll with that is impressive. You must have so much stamina. Oh, hello there, guys. What's going on here? We got a team of three. I'll just buff up right here. No big deal. Hi there, wizard. <laughs> Wait. Oh, that, is, that, is that the host? I don't know which one the host is, to be honest. Um, tough to say. Get some buffs going here. And then let's bring out, you know what, the halberd seems like it might be pretty good here. There's wizards involved, so. Hey, it didn't pop my bubble, nice. Oh, well, there goes, I don't know if it's this. I think it might be actually. This one kind of looks like it's got wizard colors to him. Maybe I'm wrong. Oh, I was right. <laughs> A slight gold tinge on this wizard. Ooh, Faramazula, and they are over there. Okay, you know what? Honestly, this could be the good time to test the bow. I just need to get within range where I can use the Ash of War. 
think they know my plan. They're hidden right where I can't lock on. Aha, now I can though. That's only the host though, I'm pretty sure. Where is the phantom? Oh. Oh, hang on, go up there, please. Oh, I was a little late in firing that. But this wall will not fully protect you if you're standing too close to it. Frankie. I'll try and hit him at the edge. Oh, oh he stopped to heal. What? Nice! Oh wait, did I? Oh, I thought I full knocked Frankie. I'm coming, guys. Hey, guys. Whee! Wait, is it just you? I swear it's not. Oh, that's your death, Frankie. <laughs> I swear. Okay, no, that's the Phantom. There is a host here. Are you guys both wielding the Great Shield? And a spear? You must be. Hey there. Oh. That was weird. It, like, stunned me before I even got to him. He's right behind me, isn't he? Ha <laughs> Sir. I'm not prepared yet. Oh, well, I guess that kind of works. Hey there. Hey there, man. <laughs> uh, it looks like you weren't the master of the corners after all. The Mausoleum. Ooh, with King Vic 22. Hello, guys. How are you? Um, I have a little bit of a setup I need to do here. It's, um, it's very important. Oh, no. You know my weakness to the pebbles. <laughs> Get them away. I'm leaving. Hey. Oh, I didn't know what in camp. Wait. Wait. What hit me? <laughs> I'm actually confused. <laughs> Who fired that? Maybe the back phantom? That's a possibility, I suppose. Now we go here. Perfect. I will fight you with a bow. Don't make me. Any more projectiles and I'm going bow. <laughs> Alright, we're going bow. That is the outcome here. Hey guys. That's what you get. You wanted the projectile war, I'll give it to you. <laughs> Alright my friend, I'm coming around the corner. Oh, I missed. <laughs> the fact that you didn't hit me is funny. Alright, so we're gonna have a nice 1v1 with the bow. Roll. Perfect. 873 is crazy. <laughs> you can two shot with this bow. Well, I guess three if they have like 2000 HP, but still. It's a nice boost to this. And I didn't even have the poison going. Oh, because I took off the talisman, that's right. Alright, those are all the invasions that I have for you guys for today with the Glass Cannon Strength build. As you can see, it performs pretty well. Even when you do trade, you seem to out-damage them since the damage on your weapons just gets so high with all of the buffs going. I have really been enjoying trying out all the different builds on this type of setup, so if there is one you'd like to see, comment it below. I do appreciate all the input that you guys give. Until the next video, this is goodbye. I will see you all next time. Thanks so much for watching. Goodbye. Goodbye.